Welcome one and all, whoever may be watching this, this will be Paper Lily, Chapter 1, Part 7. Just a shout out if you made it this far in the playthrough or if you're watching this video, I just want to say thank you, I really appreciate your time. Let's jump into it. Right, it has actually been a hot second since I last played, so once again, I'll have to orient myself with the keys. Okay, nothing to interact with right now. It's a lamppost, yay! Got some nice shrubbery. Oh, lavender flowers. Oh, that's so cute. Oh yeah, take it. I've picked up so many things that I haven't ever used. I'm sure there are so many things in this game that I've missed. Okay, a door with two doorknobs. Take a closer look. Yes. Hmm. A strange door with two doorknobs and empty slots to place more. Amazing! My return doorknob fits right in. It wasn't a scam after all. Still, I'm not ready to go home yet, but I'm glad I found this door. Oh, whoops. I didn't mean to actually go through it. Hi there. There's a shadow of a girl sitting on the other side of the desk. Hello? Um, what do you do here? Is she giving me something? Oh, we got a rainbow potion. Oh, thank you. I guess. Rainbow potions will increase your endurance permanently. It is recommended to drink them as soon as possible. Okay, some papers with opening hours and upcoming shop discounts. Do not enter. The door is locked. I mean, look, the last thing that told me to not do something, I went ahead and did it, so, you know. Okay, so apparently we should drink this potion as soon as possible. Okay, you feel somewhat stronger now. Can I crush trees with my bare hands? A small pond. Oh, cute. Oh, yay, I got a coin. I just, I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing right now. Okay, apparently we can interact with the different doorknobs. Oh, okay. There we go. I just didn't realize that was a thing. Oh, there's a tent. And the music stopped. This is a bit ominous. Make it stop! Shut him up! I can't. I tried everything. Useless! Oh, I swear I'm going to lose it. Oh, good. Someone else came. Hey, Blondie, take this stupid piece of rubbish and throw it in the lake or something. Squash it, strangle it, eat it. I don't care what you do. Oh, what? Our baby brother here has been crying non-stop for the last few days. Brother? In the terrarium. Oh no. <laughs> You're all moths? We won't be for long because this obnoxious brat is going to make me kill myself. Ah, oh, will you at least shut the hell up while I'm talking? <laughs> is he even saying anything? Would you be so kind as to kill it for us? Me? Kill the caterpillar? Yes. Yes! Why don't you do it? 
If we kill one of our kind, a curse is planted on us. Please kill him for us. We're willing to reward you with this doorknob. A doorknob. Why won't he just stop? I'm exhausted. Um, should I kill the caterpillar? I mean, I guess? Okay. You'll kill him? I guess so. Thank the heavens. You shut the hell up. You're dead meat, jerk. Farewell, little brother. It has been a displeasure. What now? Let's take it somewhere. Maybe? Can we just, like, set it free? release it around this area bye little bro Oh my gosh, the silence, it's so damn good. Here you go, you earned it. Not sure why you'd want it though. Thanks. We really appreciate it. Alright, so I've got the exit doorknob and now I've got this new doorknob. Um. Doorknob with eye. Hmm. Oh, yeah? Oh, am I just putting it somewhere? Uh, door with eye. I don't know. A stairway. It's so dark, I can't see anything. Well, if only you had your candle still, Lacey. Have I just killed her? Oh, my head. What's going on? I should have saved it before we did this. I'm such an idiot. Oh, okay, she's sleeping. Huh? Did I pass out? That's not good. My head hurts. Wasn't I going down some stairs? I hope I didn't fall and break my neck. That would be a terrible ending. I mean, I think if you're sleeping, or if you're having this dream, there's a good chance you are just unconscious, Lacey. I think you're okay. Okay, this door still doesn't open. Oh, we've got options. A second door? Hmm? Huh? Is that the shadow person? Oh, Lacey, there you are. I called you several times, didn't you hear me? I need you to go get me a... A what? A knife, Lacey. Oh. It shouldn't be too hard to find. It's in the closet in the garage. Okay. That's an odd place for a knife. <laughs> but which closet, mother? Not here. Not here. I I don't feel so good. Whoopsies, did I kill her? In her dream? What happened? Uh looks like I got the knife somehow. 
Stabby stabby time. A knife, Lacey. A knife. Oh, oh, hold on. Yeah, sorry. I need to give it to her, actually. Well done. Off you go. Um, what you cutting up there, mother? Oh, it's another red thing. Sure. I don't know what all these red items are for, but... Okay, so none of it can be used. The surfaces are completely flat and there are no handles. But I see handles. It only looks like a kitchen on the surface. What about the fridge? Oh, okay. The game is like, you cannot do anything here, get out. Passageway is closed behind you. Oh, that's awkward. That's not anything. I wonder what would have happened if I went through the other doorway. Ah, we're in jail. Excellent. Where am I? Is this a prison cell? I need to find a way out. Oh. <laughs> it was just open? Subject 66, age 33, 38, sorry, sex, female, status, incapaci whoa. incapacitated, extraction scheduled, priority medium. That's not me. Someone else must have been kept in here. Yeah, good. I was going to say Lacey is not in her 30s. These are my things, most of it anyway. I hadn't even noticed I'd lost them. Why are they here? She said most of them. Uh, okay, we can move a box around. I just, I don't know if I should interact with any of the doors. Will I kill, I just, I haven't saved the game. I should have done that beforehand. Okay, this door doesn't seem to open. So I am trapped here after all, just not in that tiny cell. I suppose that's less bad. Let's hope there's another way out. Um, yeah, okay, thank you. Okay, climb onto the box. Yes, do all of those things, please. Yes, do all of those things, please. Climb into the vents, that's what we're doing, sorry. Is there a sweet, sweet crow around? Ow. There's someone there. Wait, I have something for this situation. Good try, Lacey. Did she just throw salt in my face? Y yes Uh, why? I thought you were a demon. And if I was a demon, you think table salt would have stopped me? I, I didn't have any holy salt. That's ridiculous. Salt has no effect. I read it somewhere. This is the funniest thing that happened all week. Sorry, sorry. 
I'm sorry. What brings you to a place like this? Oh, I see, I see. Whoa, really? Who are you talking to? I didn't say anything. I know, it's a joke. Just filling the silence. You're not really talkative, huh? No, not really. Wait, wait. wait you're just leaving? Yes. That's not where the exit is. Why don't we... Uh-oh. Why don't we run? One second thought that direction's good. Go, 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 go. You don't want to run into that thing. Better hide here. Oh, Lacey's... Oh, yeah. Okay, this is all just happening. I'm not doing any of it. Nice! Oh, this place looks so pleasant. This place looks worse than just staying out there. Oh, he locked the door. Holy crap, this room is worse than just staying in the hallway. Okay, a closet of medical supplies. Smells really bad. Something in the drawer. Excellent, we got a fuse. Fallen book. Sure. The soul does not reside in a specific physical location. The torso must be dissected in its entirety in order for the extraction to be successful. Yeah, that sounds great. A whiteboard that has been mostly erased. Only a few sticky notes with strange symbols remain. Cage filled with bones. Bloody bag. The smell is putrid. Okay, there is a gate there. Medication bottles. Medication. Just don't know if we might need to take any of it. It doesn't look like it. None of these are crows. Okay. There's a gate here, but it's locked. I don't have anything. Okay, faint blood stains. What's with the strange shape of this bed? Good question, Lacey. Uh oh. Indeed, the expected outcome of a light switch. Hey! Don't be sassy with me. Oh, I didn't catch your name earlier. Yeah, I see. Um. What's up? What, what was that thing? Huh, you can talk. I don't know, they call it a primal demon. Primal? Well, if you consider all these lively fellows you encountered demons, then that would make those shadowy ones primal demons. Hmm. What else do you know? I know lots of stuff. About primal demons? Uh, about that? Not much. I know they'll kill whatever crosses their path. Contrary to other demons, which will mostly only kill you if you're human, Hmm. It might be gone. It's up to you when you want to go back out. Well, I mean, there's not much else to do here, is there? Like, the gate's locked. Let's see what happens. I guess the coast is clear? Will I find any clues in a place like this? Maybe I should focus on getting out of here. Alright. 
Um, okay. Lots of locked gates and jank. Um, did I adopt a stray? Are you following me? Yep. We stand a better chance together, right? Don't worry, I won't be a dead weight. Well, unless I'm actually dead. But then you can just leave me there. Look, you can just pretend I'm not here if you want. See? Okay. I just want a crow. If I could just save my progress before I get murdered by this monster. Oh yes, right there. Hey. Ooh. Missile. Shh. I don't give my name to just anyone, Rune. Very wise. What? You told this goblin your name, but not me? You're still suspicious. Suspicious? What can I even do with your name? This is ridiculous. I read of a curse that can kill someone just by writing their name in a notebook. Is that the same place you read about the salt? Hello, Mr. Sai. Yo. Rune, you know him? Yes, though my encounters with Mr. Sai are often brief as he does not provide me with runes. Oh. Give me a break, man. It's not like those things are just lying around. <laughs> How did you get here? I walked. I see. Unfortunately, I'm still looking for the lighthouse. Oh. The lighthouse isn't here. You must have taken a wrong turn somewhere. And there's no way to go back outside from here. What? We're stuck here? Possibly. Some doorknobs are one way only. Rune, do you have any idea where I could go from here to reach the lighthouse? The only way forward is by going deeper down. The stairs are right there, in fact. Alright, so the middle stairs. That looks like a dead end. Yes, death is a high probability at all times. But I heard there's a cursed door down there somewhere. If you're lucky, it might lead you somewhere. Or if you're unlucky, it might not. Another cursed door, huh? If there's a cursed door, then maybe there's a way out of here. Or at the very least, I could still go home if I'm stuck. I have the doorknob after all. The doorknob? When I got it in the mail, it came with instructions, almost like a ritual. It involved folding my ritual letter into an origami lily and placing it in some vase. I thought it was a joke, but... It's imperative that you learn how to fold it. If you don't, you'll regret it. Anyway, I brought the folding instructions with me, just in case. Okay. I mean, if she's had this on her the entire time, how did we just obtain it? Yo, you there? You're spacing out. Uh, yeah? Good luck on your quest. Alright, let's save and end this. It might be a bit of a longer one. Are you friends with the crows? Hey, what's wrong with that? <laughs> I feel like because of Sai's comment about runes not just lying around, they must be lying around and I've just missed them all. 